from the Partridge family to, well, I'm not exactly sure what you're doing now, but that's what I want to know. Oh, I'm doing concerts all over the country. I just came back from Iowa and Pittsburgh. I did a concert there. And the whole Christmas week, we're, my son Patrick and I are going to be up at Thousand Oaks Performing Arts Center doing Christmas shows, five shows. So how is it working with your son? I love it. He's great. He's very talented. Is he, he, is he your manager by any chance, too? He's not? No, no, okay. no. That, that, that's Cloris. Cloris Leachman's son is her manager. <laughs> so you were the mother on the Partridge family, and we also have... Um, Florence, uh -huh. who was on the Brady Bunch, the mother on the Brady Bunch. Are you guys very close? Yeah, we know you kind of share that in common? Uh, yes, we do. Yeah, we do. Yeah. We've known each other. We knew each other before television. We knew each other from Broadway. Wow. Yeah, because... That's something I didn't even know. I was on Broadway and so was she about the same time. We what show were you doing? I was doing South Pacific. I was in the chorus. And she, I forget what show she was doing, but she, she did a show with my then husband, Jack Cassidy. They were in the show together. So how exactly did you meet Florence while you guys were working on different shows? You yeah, just ran we, into each you know, other? we met in New York, and, you know, we talked in New York. Everybody kind of gets to know everybody if you were doing a show on Broadway. You all meet at a certain restaurant afterwards and stuff like that. But I never really got to know her and talk to her at great length until we, you know, until we came out here, until we did the shows. So would you like better Broadway or movies and television? I love it all. <laughs> I still love it all. It's a good answer. <laughs> yeah, I really do. I mean, I, I'm up for two movies now, too, so we'll see what happens there. And so what movies are those? A little, a little bit of it. I'm not, I'm not about to say right now. <laughs> Can you give us maybe like an idea of what the two may be involving? Well, one or your about character? About the Manson girls, if you recall the, you know, Charlie Manson. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's a very, very deep, dark movie, script, but very well done, very well written. Will your character be deep and dark? More or less. Yeah. Well, then I hope it comes out. It would be nice to see you do something like that. <laughs> yeah, I would love to do something From like that. From the smiles to the darkness. I know, I love that. I don't know if I could even picture that, but I'm sure you're amazing. Well, so I I... Academy Award for playing a prostitute. So. Okay. Well, yeah, then totally. But it's a totally different even realm, you know? I know, yeah, yeah, of course. How do you prepare yourself for something like that? Depends on the part. Depends on the part, you know. So how about the part where you were actually the prostitute? How do you prepare for something like that? Well, <laughs> that's not easy. <laughs> but I had read the novel prior to that, and, you know, she, she became a prostitute because of Elmer Gantry. She was actually a minister's daughter. So she was brought up, you know, so there was that sort of that conflict that happened. And it was a very right character for me. Tom. That's crazy, but it sounds like fun. It's fun. <laughs> and that's the best part of acting. You get to try out different roles. I know. And love that. Experience something different. Yeah, exactly. Well, enjoy tonight. Thank you. You're here to support Doris, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Wonderful. Well, yeah, enjoy we are. everything. Yeah. It was really nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. <laughs>